what the teachers want is something to work as in with three clicks. They want to go there, find it in five minutes, click on it, and it has to be in their own computer or it has to be on their Beamer, it has to be on their Moodle site or, or their own learning management system. Like, does it take little time? Do I find what I want? Can I use it in my class? That's it. I don't care how you made it that appear. If it's metadata, if it's uh, packaged, it is, uh, I don't care. I just want it quickly and to the point. Now these teachers at the very beginning, they did not understand. They did not understand, they did not care really about packaging or, or SCORM or common cartridges. At the beginning of the workshop, they still rolled their eyes when they said, where are we going to be talking about packaging? And by the end of the day, they had been integrating common cartridge package into their into model or into their blogs, and uh, they were they their view of it changed completely. And they were like, "How can I get my model platform to actually accept common cartridge?" It it was very exciting to see that actually quite a lot of the teachers, which we didn't even chose for their skills of IT, that they could actually work with these standards and. Uh, could get quite excited about, for example, taking a common cartridge package and putting it to Moodle. The most advanced teachers, they would actually want to create the packages themselves. They like the idea that uh, they create resources and they package in such a way that somebody else can take them and integrate them very easily into their own system. The enthusiasm we found was uh, actually very impressive. Teachers want things that help their teaching or their preparing their classes. SCORM allows that. SCORM gives you a pack, uh, gives you a resource that is self-contained, you just grab it and it has everything you need for that lesson. But teachers also want the freedom to do whatever they want in their class without being imposed a uh, rhythm or a certain amount of topics. Common Cartridge allows you to do that. It, you take it, it's easy also to integrate once you're trained to do it. and you can take the parts you want of the resource. I think that standards for packaging is uh, something that the teachers don't have to know about. It should be basically invisible for them. It should be no matter what kind of interface there is, as long as it's something that they can use, they're interested in mainly what is easy to use, what is modifiable and uh, what will give them the best quality content. Uh, faith on the fact that uh, when these tools will actually develop further, uh, they will be easy to use, they will be just like office tools or something that they work with every day. I think the standards are at their best when you forget that they exist. Then they have achieved what the standard should achieve. Google is done for free and it's done for everybody and anybody can use it and, and in a way they have low expectations of it. But the LRE, because in theory it's backed up by the ministry, it's, uh, it's uh, specifically targeted for, for teachers, uh, they expect it to work better than, than Google in a way. They expect that when they look for re resources on a certain subject and a certain age, they expect resources to be there. And very important, they really expect uh, to be able to navigate in their own language. Why would they use it, you know, besides Google? They will still keep on using Google, but LRE will now provide them something that they know. They've started to trust it because they've gotten to know it. They know how it works. They know what the benefits are. They know, for example, from today, that they can go to the LRE, take a common cartridge package, put it to Moodle, take just the bits of it that they like, and then it's ready for them to use. So it's, it's something amazing. They were trying it today with their own learning, mani learning management systems and they, they were very happy on what they saw. <laughs>